Hey guys, welcome to today's video. We are doing something entirely different. A lot of you guys have been requesting some type of a fashion haul. And because I recently went on like a big pajama bra panty binge, I thought I would just share with you what I am into. You might find this video really, really random. I myself, I love seeing these kind of hauls. I'm totally gonna try on everything for you. So this is a try on bra haul. <laughs> I am not doing that. That's never gonna happen. Nonetheless, I am gonna be holding up underwear. So let me just throw that out there. I am really, really picky about bras and I'm really picky about what I sleep in. I usually go for 100% comfort and I love me some good sweatpants, but I'm trying to kind of class it up a little bit. And I recently discovered something so totally random. For Christmas, my girlfriend Irene got me like a really cute pajama set from Victoria's Secret. It was just like a night shirt and I was kind of looking at it like, oh my god, no. Like she always like rants and raves. She's like, it's the most comfortable thing to sleep in. You feel so good. It's so free and you just feel great. And I, I gave it a try. And I fell in love. I was like, oh my gosh, well, I've been missing this my whole life. What is wrong with me? Let me just show you like the non-sexy ones really quick and then we'll get to the sexier ones. So I am super into just pajama dresses, like short little pajama shirt dresses. This is the most comfortable way to sleep. I just love the way it feels. I don't know why. I just, I used to think that you would just get tangled up in something like this but no, you don't. So this one is from Nordstrom. This is the Make Model brand. I think this is just a Nordstrom brand. And I had purchased a few t-shirts from them a while back and really loved how they held up. So I saw this and I was just like, oh my gosh, flowers, why is this so cute? This is so comfortable and sexy at the same time. You put a little robe on top of it and you just feel really cute. And again, it's just so nice to sleep in a dress. I'm gonna say that like 50,000 times in this video, but that's just how I feel right now. So this one is from Victoria's Secret and I did get the matching undies. Um, I can't sleep in a thong. It's just not gonna happen ever. That's never gonna happen. Um, so I go like full granny with like the boy shorts, but I think they're sexy and cute, so I don't care, whatever. And then, I just got a black one as well. Yes, so much comfort, I love it. And Victoria's Secret year round, they always have these kind of slips that are really cute in the back and you can always find a matching underwear and yes, hearts. I gotta represent, I'm born on Valentine's Day so it doesn't matter how old I get, the heart situation is going to continue. This is from PJ Salvage and I highly, highly recommend PJ Salvage. I tried their stuff out first mm, last spring and I actually posted maybe my one and only like pajama photo on Instagram wearing a set that is very similar to this. And I loved that photo so, so much. Puka was being so cute in the background, like he was posing with me. Anyway, if you want to see that other pajama set, um, or I'll just put the photo in right here, but this is the same idea. And PJ Salvage, they wash so well. You can wash it over and over and over and they just stay really, really soft and vibrant. And they have pants if you don't wanna do shorts, but I got the shorts. I think they're adorable. So these are the shorts. And again, I'm all about things being cute, but being really soft and really comfortable and just feeling really nice on the skin. Um, so this is new for me. I'm not normally into like this type of material for some reason. This feels, I don't know. This to me feels like I don't wanna be on the couch eating a bag of potato chips. Um, but maybe that's a good thing, right? I'm not sure. This feels way more elegant and classy, but it's not like full on lingerie. So this is a little set from Victoria's Secret where you have the little cami and it's very satiny, silky. What is this actually made of? Tell me what you are made of, it's a mystery. What the hell? <laughs> Why do I find this really funny? I'm like, it's like satin, it feels good, it's so silky, I feel elegant as hell, it's awesome. This is 100% polyester. That doesn't sound so sexy. 
Anyway, um, I saw this on the mannequin in Victoria's Secret and I was like, yes, please. That looks really cute. It feels really soft. It's kind of reminding me of like a French maid or something. I don't know. Get both pieces for 52 bucks. It's Victoria's Secret. The prices can get a little bit out of control. I am a bit of a hard size. I'm a 32C. So I'm really, really tiny right here. And that can be just kind of tough to find the right fitting bra. This one I saw, I got really excited that it was in my size. It was marked down to $32 and then it was half of that. It was normally 58 and I put it on and it was just fitting me like a glove and the back part is kind of fun with this bandage type strappy material. It makes me happy. It's very padded. It makes for quite the illusion. But anyway, I like it. Talking about illusions. This is the best bra ever. If you need a bra that you can wear like a million different ways, you could wear it strapless, you could wear it with one strap, you can turn it into a halter, and you like the kind of vavoom, not just push-up bra, but like let's add a little volume to the look, do you know what I mean? But you don't want your boobs to look pointy. Uh, this is the best bra. I have repurchased this bra over and over and over. I have a nude one, I have a black one. Those are kind of like my boring whatever go-to bras. They had a new design that I thought was really pretty and could still work under a lot of, you know, dresses and clothing. Like the lace on here is not so out of control that it's gonna look kind of bunchy underneath a dress, but it's still just sexier than like the plain nude or plain black. This is the Bombshell Multi-Way and I love this. Love, love, love. It's one of the only push-up bras that I can actually go strapless in and not feel like everything's being like dragged way down to my belly button, which nobody wants. So let me just have a candid moment with you and share that this is the best major push-up bra ever. Really expensive, but worth the investment. This is oh, so scandalous. Let's just show this on camera. Um, ladies, when you are wearing a tight dress or you are wearing something that is going to grab at the panty line situation, just make sure you have something like this on hand because nobody needs a panty line that will ruin a look so so quickly. Because I bought that bra mainly for, you know, cocktail-ish attire and, you know, like a strapless dress or a dress where I need to wear like one strap or whatever, like I said, it's a multi-way. I also wanted to get the matching panty, but I wanted it to be something that I knew I could wear underneath a tight dress. And then I got a sports bra. Really random, but I have mentioned this before on my channel that I am not a fan of going to the gym and there's just like no nice way to say this. I have to have pads in my sports bras. I don't want my nipples showing. I don't want them, you know, I'm on the treadmill or in a class or whatever. You guys know what I'm talking about. No, it's just, oh my gosh, you're like sweating. The air conditioning is like hitting you and you're just like, oh my God, why is this happening right now? Um, I want none of that. I will wear a padded bra to the gym like this. And Victoria's Secret has the best sports bras. Now you know what my underwear looks like. Tee -hee -hee -hee. Every time in January, February, like start of the year, I do a full clean out and I get rid of a lot of stuff and kind of make room for for new things. And um, this year was like a pajama year. So uh, there you have that. And I hope you enjoyed something a little bit different than makeup. Let me know that you want other videos that have to do with more than just makeup, maybe a little bit of fashion, maybe a little hair. Um, let me know that you enjoyed this by giving this video a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Let me know how you're doing. And I hope you're having a good one. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. Mwah.